lovely welcome back to my youtube channel this is shan if you're new to my channel this channel is all about the life of a waitress what a waitress do on a daily basis um you know general just the life of being a waitress all right so welcome to my youtube channel if you're new please thank you for joining please share the video please um subscribe leave a comment and i'll be grateful but yes guys um so my last video was like a month ago and that was when i went to new york for my vacation however what you guys didn't know that after new york i went to hawaii i did not post any video of that because i didn't have much enough content to be honest i did a vlog a lot in hawaii unfortunately i did however enjoy myself it was a great trip i can't complain it was really really nice i really enjoyed it but unfortunately i did not get a chance to vlog as much as i would love to but yeah i will make that up to you guys in another time if i do go back or when i do go back and all of that all right so for today's video we are going to talk about things that a waiter waitresses and a bartender should have on a daily basics when they're going to work all right because you know you can't go down to a restaurant and waitress look shabby them look confused they don't know what they might do so let's get right into it all right so i'm using my little notebook right here However, I get this on Amazon, guys. Okay, so if you want it, you could go and get it. All right, so the first thing on my list is ensure that you have a neat, tidy, clean uniform. You know, ensure your uniform, iron, make sure you wash it. You understand what I say? Yes, ensure that we, you have a nice, clean, tidy uniform that include your name tag and any other badges that your company requires you to wear. All right. So that is very, very important. You can't be a waiter or a waitress or a bartender in front of guests with dirty uniform, crushed uniform. It doesn't look good. It doesn't look professional. It doesn't say much for you as an individual all right the next thing on my list is ensure that you have multiple pens not just one two or three multiple pens because i don't know if it's just me but each time i bring pen to work i either go home with none or one so we have to ensure that we have enough pen and also when you're taking orders and stuff like that we don't have to back and forth oh i can't find a pen and stuff like that that doesn't look good at all so ensure that you have enough pens on you when you're going to work every day all right the next thing on my list is an order pad every waiter waitress and bartender have to have an order pad that is a must okay what you're gonna use to the the guest order come on now talk to me we have to have an order pad um I know some people are some of us um wait our waitresses when we in this thing for a long time we tend to say oh i could memorize um i guess order that's no problem which is yes sometimes i do but ensure you have your order pad in hand because there are times when i guess um i have a lot of requirements um allergies and stuff like that we need to ensure that guests get the right food that they order so you know you don't have any problems guests don't have any allergy reaction none of that so we always have to have an order pad to write on the guest order and ensure guys please ensure that we repeat your order to the guests that's a very 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 important thing as well we should always whenever we write down the order repeat it to our guests ensure that they um you have the correct um things that they order from you all right whether it's food drinks whatever it is ensure that you repeat it to be on the safe side okay so the next thing will be apron i know um few companies require us to wear apron 
um my company doesn't require me to wear apron they do they don't provide us with any but ensure that you have that's a part of your uniform as well ensure that you have your apron it can come in handy especially when you're you know you're a calico girl shimani um you have your notepad you have your your, your pen any little necessities you could put in your your apron so it will come in and guys i would love for me to wear an apron i hope when i go back to work they put that in play now because it really come in handy um the next thing is wine opener oh my god you have to have a wine opener as long as you are a bartender a waiter or a waitress that is a must that is the company don't have to provide you with a wine opener you should have a wine opener personally that's my thought because when you're up selling when we're selling wine to guests stuff like that we need or we go open the wine for the guests we have to ensure that we have our own wine opener that is a must i know sometimes waiter our waitress depend on the bartender for a wine opener that's a no-no i think we should always have that personally for ourselves on us every day at work to make our life easier um what if the bartender is busy using their wine opener what are you gonna do stand and wait while the guests wait on you no that's that's a no-no so ensure that we have our wine opener and i'm talking about a proper wine opener guys please invest in a proper proper wine opener all right a lighter we need to fire up the lighter we need lighter once you are a waiter waitress or bartender again we need our lighter lighters are important too because what if you're having a birthday you're doing a little celebration you want to do something nice for a guest you want to light a few candles you know we don't have to be back and forth in the kitchen asking for lighters and stuff like that we have our own make our life more easier we walk less and all of that all right so ensure you you have a lighter on you every day when you're going to work the next thing is having the proper shoes this is really really important and i don't know about you guys but i know about me um if i don't wear proper shoes to work my feet hurt my feet swell i can't walk on my foot for days so you yeah, have to ensure that you have a proper shoes something that won't slide something that is very cushiony so it helps with all that long standing and back and forth and stuff like that so invest in a proper proper work shoes all right um and i think that's about it for me on my end that what i have on a daily basis when i'm when i'm going to work but it can be more to be honest it can be more um but those are the most important stuff to me that I have on a daily basis when I'm going to work. Um, if you all have any other suggestions or any other um, items, I would love to know and add it to mine. You know, because we're all here to learn and share information. So you can, you know, leave something in the comment box and I will definitely take you up on that but in the meantime between time i want you guys to um enjoy the rest of your day it was a it was great talking with you to be honest um as i said i'm going back to work i will try to do a little mini vlog slash video with all the items that i just mentioned um that i do carry on a daily basis when i'm going to work just to show you um the brand or the quality that i have it, you guys can have totally different things from what i have that's okay whatever works for you but i will show you what works for me what i feel comfortable using and stuff like that so i will try to do a video on that as well so it was great talking with you catching back up with you guys i know i'm not being consistent um that's bad i know I, I know it hurt my heart as well but uh, I don't know life <laughs> life but um I would try my best to do better and post at least every 
two weeks or so or you know I, I won't let it reach a month and don't pause I apologize for that because uh, I know a lot of people texting and saying are you putting up another video stuff like that but I will be better I promise as I grow I will get better and better um next thing please ensure that you subscribe share the video leave a comment and you know let all the bar bartenders waiter waitresses know that yeah they could come along share their ideas and you know learn to stuff as well especially the newcomers just leaving school stuff like that please run over and subscribe and then like another thing guys um i'm at four i think i'm at 400 subscribers and i would love to reach at 600 for my birthday i really really appreciate that that's all i ask i would love that for my birthday okay but anyways please enjoy the rest of your day i don't know when you guys gonna see this whether it's afternoon day night we'll see but enjoy the rest of the time that you have and i will see you guys in the next video all right peace out